My name is Shawnee Raymer. I'm a licensed and certified speech language pathologist, and I want to share a book with you today. I work for Jefferson County Public Schools. However, this is not considered to be our non-traditional instruction, nor is it considered to be telehealth or therapy. It's just a fun idea that we wanted to share with the community. Today, I would like to read Max Cleans Up by Rosemary Wells. This book is great for children learning to answer questions. Max is supposed to be cleaning his room with his sister, but instead of putting things away, he puts everything in his pocket. The repetitive nature of the story makes it a great way for children to learn to answer where questions. Max Cleans Up by Rosemary Wells. Max parked his popsicle where no one would find it. Then he pushed the up and over button on his brand new Power City Rock Crusher dump truck. Max, said Max's sister Ruby, it's time to clean up. Your dump truck goes back in the sandbox. When Ruby wasn't looking, Max emptied the dump truck into his pocket. Just then, Ruby stepped on something sticky. It was a tube of miracle bubbles. Into the rubbish, Max, said Ruby. But Max squeezed the rest of the miracle bubbles into his pocket, too. Your ant farm ants have escaped, Max, said Ruby. Back home they go. But Max let the ants run into his pocket instead of in the ant farm. Max said, Ruby, something's in your underwear drawer that should not be there. This Easter egg is from last year, Max said, Ruby. Into the trash bucket it goes. But Max stuffed the egg into his pocket. What is oozing from under your closet door, Max? asked Ruby. Max knew Ruby would find a reason to throw out his popsicle. She might even throw out his quack quack duck. They both just fit in his pocket. Max said Ruby, your pillow is in your toy chest and your toys are in your bed. Max rescued his very favorite piece of gum on a string from the bottom of his bug box. Spit it out, Max, said Ruby. Ruby put all the toys in the toy chest. She lined up the Santas and the dolls. The sneakers went into Max's closet and the wind-up bugs went into the big bug box. Max saved the gum in his pocket. Look, Max, said Ruby, your room is completely organized. There's a place for everything and everything in its place. Max, Ruby asked, what's in your pocket? Everything, said Max. Max put everything from his room. Where? In his pocket. I hope you enjoyed the story today. You can subscribe to this channel for more stories from some of our other speech language pathologists. Thanks for listening.